Hey, love bugs, it's Rosalind back at you one more again. I hope everybody is doing blessed today. I'm doing blessed and highly favored and hope the same for you. If this is your first time coming to my channel, welcome. Namaste, love and blessings, love and light, and many blessings are yet to come for you. And thank you for the love and support and coming to see my channel today. And if you have not already, please like and subscribe. Even hit that notification bell so you know when I'm about to upload my next video. And if you feel free and comfortable and would like to go ahead and put your two cents in, opinion, or whatever experience you have going on with my video, go ahead and drop me a line or two. I love to get the positive feedback and I always make sure I return the plot to the comments. And thank you for the love and support once again. And even like and share. Give me a thumbs up if you feel like you enjoyed what you had heard. And for my returning subs, what's up fam? Namaste, love and light, many blessings. Many blessings are yet to come for you. And thank you so much for the love and support today. And today I'm listening to 432 hertz. Crystal clear intuition, destroy unconscious blockages, fear, and cleanse negative energy. So if you'd like to listen to that uh, meditation, I'll go ahead and put it in the link down below. Put it in the description box with the link down below. And my video is about Twin Flame 101. Hey Opus, is it hard for you to make and keep friends? Oh my goodness. It's hard for me. <laughs> it's hard. It seems like I have more conversations with y'all going back and forth with the comments and, you know, you showing love and support than I do actually in the world unless I'm at work. So it's crazy. I, you know, especially I don't know. It's like it's sad because I can't really open up to anybody. And it's like what at my job, there are sometimes I will sit up here and hear my dad's song being played and I'm just sitting up here like I could have went all day without hearing that and they were like why you don't like Prince and I'm like no it's not dad it's a long story <laughs> you know you know and I have to really cut that conversation short and just walk off so you know and it's really hard for me to do that because it's like when I've had friends before it's like the most recent ones is like when they found out when you know the ish really hit the fan some became, you know, kind of distant. Some became to the point where they turned on me and told everybody about my situation and they mocked me about it. So it's been some kind of hard, you know, dealing with that. You know, or I have somebody bragging like, hey, you know, I know Prince's daughter and this and this and that. I'm like, hey, I don't. <laughs> Can you stop telling people that? You know, and so it was. it's just hard to know if somebody's really there for you. If they're really there because they, you know, you you're, you're vibing with them. They, you know, you're on a you're on a good level with them, and y'all seeing you know seeing the same views and have the same interests and stuff like that. I really need that in my life. But you know, I have you know a few people I still talk to and stuff like that, but it's not many. So it, it's just people that do know the situation. They're like, you know, I don't understand how. That, that has to be hard to be able to have to keep something like this to yourself. And it's just like, yeah, because it's like, it's hard to actually know who's there for you for a real deal. Or they looking for a handout when stuff gets good. You know, you never know. So it's just like, I have to feel the vibes out. And it's just like bad, you know, being a hey but you know, we feel everything. And it became a problem to me and I'm just wondering am I the only one who has to go through that because it's like you already can feel off the vibes that some people are getting and they you know and they come at you you know you never know what their intentions are and it might not be even something that they're projecting towards you it could be something that they're actually going through so I was just wondering if you know if any of you know, the viewers are going through something like that, you know, or it's hard for you to open up and make friends because you have went through things and you have been done wrong so many times, or it's just the fact is that you attract negative things or people that you have had recently, you know, really didn't mean you any good. So I was just wondering if you had to go through that and, you know, if you feel comfortable enough, go ahead and drop a line or two and let me know what your experience was about it or, or you know, if you have something in common with me you would like to share.
you know, greatly be appreciated. So I'm not trying to hold you up. I hope everybody is blessed. I will keep you in my prayers and I hope you do the same for me. Please like and subscribe. Even hit that notification bell so you know when I'm about to upload my next video. Drop a line or two. I love to get the positive feedback. Give me a thumbs up, like, share. It will greatly be appreciated. And I will see you on my next video. Stay blessed. Peace. And be wild.